Hey everyone, Rusty Otter out here in Peoria Heights of Wisconsin. No. No, we're otters. We go around making sure that the cops don't take our rights away. Somebody but... has got a camera going. Thank you. Yes. That's what I can tell them. Roll it. Roll it. Yep. Roll it. Roll that. Yeah, thank you. Yes. I'm Rough the Otter, and, and that's Lone Wolf my Community Watch. Right What's going right. on, man? Rough Lone Wolf Community Watch. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> All right, you too, man. Well, that's what I'm talking about. All right. Yep, yep. Yep. All right. Let's get out of the way. We got cops chasing two black teen males and one black teen female that have been burglarizing personal vehicles in the area. They're all the way going to the next block. We went straight through to the next block. Alright. Oh. Guess they got some here. Huh. Well, they got. I about hit coming across in front of me. Well, they got the female. But she's quick. Damn. You'll be alright. That's just her, that's just her job. Yep. Well, as you can see, they have the female. Jeans? Yeah. And now they're looking for the two male teens still. And she's crying her butt off now in the back of the truck. And that's squad vehicle 583 of Peoria Police Department. And we got both Peoria Police Department and Peoria Heights working together, still trying to find the two males. So. The one and only time. Uh, I'm really not, guys. Sorry. Uh. Okay, so we're in, right on the cusp between Peoria and Peoria Heights. Um, off of, let's see here, where are we at? Uh, I was mistaken, it's not Wisconsin, we're off at, let's see, it'd be Atlantic and War Memorial in Peoria, Illinois, Peoria County, Peoria Heights, Cusp area. Um, they're caught the female and looking for the two males of the three teens that have been burglarizing all the vehicles around the area lately. They, we just, well, they just caught the female because we almost hit her when she ran across us running from the cops. And they caught her. Now they're looking for the two uh, teen males. Yeah. Um, over uh, across the way. But they've been hitting from all the way from here all the way down to Fry. Have you been hit? No, I haven't, but my neighbor was. We were. You guys were? I thought I heard something. Yep, well, they got the female, and they're looking for the two males. And she's already just blabbing away to the cops, so they'll have the guys soon enough. Well, she's crying, going, first time I've been in trouble, I got to go to school tomorrow, and just going on and on and on. Where were they at? Uh, they were, when they got spotted, they were at off uh, 1,000 block of Richwoods, across Prospect. How big is here? Running. Oh, running. Yeah, they, well, the unfortunate thing for them is, 
cops' radios are faster than a person walking. So, all right, well, I'm going to go see if they got the other two yet. Have a good evening. So there you go, folks. There's one of the people that did get hit by these robbers. We got one cop still parked in the back of the lot there. We got a couple up on the cement areas looking around. But one of the two, the best bar and restaurant in the area. You got Schooner's Bar and Grill right along with their Gebby's Family Restaurant for breakfast and lunch. Right across from the Super Liquors. So we got vehicle 515 right here. As I'm walking down War Memorial Drive. Eight hundred block east War Memorial Block or War Memorial Drive. Oh, well, here we go, folks. They got him. Yeah, they got him. Yep. And the other took off. I don't know why. Hey, AK to the mommy. Out here with the rest of the audio room tonight. As you can tell, me and Lone Wolf out here again as always. So they caught the three gen or two gentlemen and a female. And the other female who ran they caught earlier. So let's see, we got vehicle 551, we got vehicle 599, and I can't see the other squad vehicle, I'm not going to go up and other them while they're talking to people. So. There's a three teen sitting up on the wood wall talking to the cops. So, if you're just tuning in, of course, this is Ref the Auditor out here with Lone Wolf Community Watch on a cop stop of teenagers breaking into vehicles in the surrounding area. We're on the 800 block of East War Memorial Drive in Peoria Good, on the cusp of Peoria Heights, Peoria County. You guys didn't, uh, see that, uh, um, I want to say thank you to all my subs out there. For those of you that haven't subbed, please do. The more the merrier. And then say thank you for all you that do watch please give a thumbs up if you like it leave a comment I know I know I know I know I know let me keep talking I'm talking thank you so so let's give him room so we're not in the way he's got the female That's Lone Wolf down there on the other side of this block. So as 
I was saying. Well, that helped give some light on the subject, didn't it? So, but as I was saying to everyone, thank you for watching, subbing. Please sub if you haven't. Good. Good, how are you? Good. See, that's what we like to see. Cops that walk by, say hello, say good evening. Don't bother us, let us videotape. And that's it. So, oh, well, there goes 599. Uh, this is sergeant's vehicle C564 so now they're just still talking like teens says excuse me kind formal knows my rights to where they don't say anything so now I think it's just a fish you know, expedition a little bit to the point of where they're trying to see if they'll mess up and say something. So. So the girl that was just taken away by a cop was being taken home because I guess she had nothing to do with it, just got with the group as they were walking over here trying to act their way out of the situation, but they're still being held and questioned. So now it's just wait and see what they do, talk with the sergeant. Probably get a hold of the parents since they're minors. But this is why you learn early. Crime doesn't pay. So. Go Sarge. Have a good night. C five six four out of the area.
five, six, four, it's left the building, everybody. So now it's just That's called the lighter that would not light. Sorry guys, finally got my cigarette lit. <laughs> it happens. But for those of you tuning in, Rough the Auditor out here with Longwood Community Watch. 800 block of East War Memorial Drive. Pretty much cutting the line between Peoria and Peoria Heights, Illinois, here in Peoria County on a cop stop of cop stop of teens because there's been a area wide vehicle burglaries and these guys waited for the cops go by until they started to run out and the only reason Lone Wolf and I know that is because they almost ran out in front of us after the cops had passed trying to get across the street uh, the girl that was with them <laughs> ran faster went across War Memorial and got spotted as she was trying to run away and got caught these two were found over here and stopped and has been questioned since So now it's, I don't know if they're waiting on the parents. So now they're being spotlighted. There's someone to look to see if that's who they saw. So they didn't get the parents. They went and got the burglarized person. Oh, we got a state cop here now. I cop turned his spotlight off of the guys and took off, so if there's a person that was in the vehicle with them, they're getting them out, so that way the, these are the guys that did it. They won't see who just busted them for what they did. must have been the sergeant that went and got the person to come back, so. Been on here now for going on 20 minutes. And going strong as always for you guys.
Then cops gain information from one of the boys. Now I'm going to the other boy. So. So now let's check and make sure this that's a state boy or a county boy. But he's taken off now since everything's kosher. Sorry if it's a little jumpy tonight. Uh, didn't have my gimbal with me. So, yep, state police. <laughs> he gave me the siren. <laughs> Kind of funny, gave me the siren. <laughs> Can I hit him for noise pollution because it's after midnight? <laughs> I guess not, but funny anyway for me. So I guess now they're just waiting to hear back from the sergeant or from the parents, one or two. I know it's hard to see, but you got one big cop right there with another cop standing behind him that you can't see from his build. The two boys on the wood retainer wall, and then the one cop on the right. So, okay, there he stepped away. See, I wasn't fibbing. There was another cop behind the big guy. <laughs> That's the one heist cop that everybody hates. Big boy. He's the one that doesn't know how to run, can't run, sits in his car all the time. But. Let's see if one of them tries to come to me about my cigarettes since I just filled script it, whether they saw it or not. They're going to take them home since they're minors. So, this cop's going to be taking this gentleman home. Mr. Not Right Said Fred's taking the other one home. As you know, he's way too, not too sexy for his car. <laughs> So, this is the Heights squad car, which is 980. So, now they're all going to head out and be...
out and done. So I guess we are too for now. So thank you for tuning in. Ruff the Otter with Lone Wolf Community Watch. Saying thank you to everybody watching. Don't forget to hit that like button. If you're a sub again, thank you. If you haven't subbed yet, please do. The sooner I get to a thousand, the sooner that I can live stream and you can see this full hand. And like I said before, I'm a true auditor. I do nothing but uncut raw footage. I will not cut anything. I will not take out stuff. I will not fast forward. 515 heading out and turning around to drop off. Hey, yeah. Well, there you go. They're done. I guess we're done for now. So, and I was wrong. It was not Atlantic. We were on. Illinois and War Memorial so but well test time which may be soon we will catch you later Ref the other out